This week, Governor Kristi Noem announced a $10 million funding project for South Dakota's four technical colleges. Our Kyle Clark spoke with the president of Western Dakota Technical College to see what those funds mean for the school. Western Dakota Technical College is the only tech school in Rapid City, and now some of their programs will see new equipment. In particular, machining is a program that recently expanded the CNC capabilities for students in it, so we need to get more CNC equipment. In addition to that, we have some equipment that we need to update in our automotive tech program and our diesel program as well. Additionally, funds will go towards purchasing lab equipment such as new surgical tables, also, equipment will be purchased for a new licensed practical nursing site in Hot Springs. According to Bowman, purchasing new equipment is necessary for the school to ensure the students have the most up-to-date training in their chosen field. The, having the equipment that is in use in industry means that when our students leave the programs, they will be very comfortable with the equipment that they will be working with on the job site. This is important <laughs> for any field, but particular in tech, particularly in technical fields, it makes a huge difference in a student's ability to get the job done correctly the first time. The upgrades are thanks to money from future funds, announced by Governor Kristi Noem. WDT will receive $1.6 million in funds matched by the school, bringing the total investment to more than $2 million. The purchase of the new equipment is expected to take place during the 2023-2024 academic year. Reporting for Coda Territory News, I'm Kyle Clark.